Hey guys, so today I wanted to do sort of a review slash react to all the present uh, plasma toroid products on the market. I know there's a good amount now. And the main reason I wanted to do this video is because one of my patrons who joined my Patreon about a year ago, he turned the circuit into a product. And that's one of the ones I'm gonna review today. Okay, here it is. Here's the game plan for today. I'm not sure if it's focusing. I shall trust that it is. All right, let's check out these plasma toroids. Okay, so as you can see, here's my screen. Okay, so first, Zerg Labs. I bet I can, yeah. Bagel Gen, it's called the Bagel Gen. It's like a bagel generator, plasma bagel generator. Yeah, so I mean, Bagel Gen, it is the first commercialized plasma toroid generator. That's for sure. First of its name, that's true as far as I know. And I do like the website design. Um, and of course, I mean, Zerg's very smart. So the, uh, the science behind it is explained well here. How does it work? I inductively coupled plasma. Yeah, he's a, he's a beast, like uh, makes all the amazing uh, plasma mixes, makes the flasks and the electronics. And so here we have the case, like the birthday cake style case. I mean, it's all right. It's all right. I mean, you can see internal electronics glowing inside and you know, it's better than I can do, so. That's good. And then let's see what we got here. Prices. So second gen, 400 US dollars. First gen, $300. Uh, I don't know, reflect on, I guess I'll reflect on the price. I mean, if it's, if it's worth it to you, get it. For people who don't know electronics, I suppose it's, it's worth that much, but you can, you can learn. You, I mean, you saw my video, you can make this. Uh, but there are some difficulties like heating and, and reliable ignition, of course. So there's several different options. I like it. The photos are chosen well. I like the website. And then, of course, he's the king of plasma toroid flasks. Bagel Torch. Oh, it's just, this has been launched. I've been seeing this on his Tesla, on his Telegram channel, but I didn't know it was on his site yet. $1,500. That's like a really good laptop right there. And yeah, there's just lots of good documentation. He's constantly updating the website. And yeah, look at all these plasma toroid options. Lots of options here at bagelgen.com. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is like an obsession, but no, we, we know that. Uh, Awesome. This is just an incredibly complete website. So nice bagel gen. Let's move on to aloe. All right. So my Patreon made this, uh, Sung Yu Lee, I think. So here it is. First floating plasma toroid lamp. I mean, that's debatable, of course, but it is very financially successful, as you can see here. The marketing is really good here. As you can see, the enclosure quality is a bit higher than the Bagel Gen, but that's just because that's what Allo wanted to do. They wanted, they took a bit more time, I guess, developing it, or they just wanted like a more mass product look to it. Looks like Fox has reported on it. That's pretty cool. Great photography of it, once again here. And this is cool, like wave mode, spin mode, halo mode. I have that on all, on my plasma toroid generator, so that's pretty cool. Uh, yep, they set it up in like a house set to make it be like, this is what it would look like in your house. So I was really excited to see those updates on, uh... hey, I know those pictures. 
if you don't know, that's from my videos. These two are from my videos. This one is from my most popular plasma toroid video, and then this one's from my Instagram. Uh, it doesn't mention back max psi. I will say that, but not that he needs to. But this is this is my content. Um, technology explained uses Tesla coil and high frequency oscillation. So this is a little more surface level explanation. And then look at this. This is like some some prototyping theater here. Some taking things apart like and, and stuff. And so this is what's inside it, I, I am assuming. I like it, I like it, it's pretty. Yeah, so advanced safety. So I'm pretty sure this is a Stratman globe. And then this is, okay, I think it's pretty funny. This uh, diffuser function where you just drop uh, an a aromatic oil on it, I guess, and it'd be like, it can also fill your room with aroma. Yeah, I don't know how much I'd use that, but it would definitely do that because the glass gets hot from the plasma. Got a how to use guide. I guess we could watch that. Okay, full screen this guy. You plug it in and how do you operate it? You turn the bias all the way, no. And you ignite it. Yeah, and you can turn the bias to change the modes. Okay, that's pretty straightforward. That makes sense. And I'm curious to see what electronics are inside it to uh, make sure that it doesn't overheat. Connect the adapter. Yeah, so it's very clear how to use it. Give some specs. Only 80 watts power draw. Okay. And then here's this power buck boost power supply they put in there. This looks like, okay. No offense, but it looks like it's from an Ali, it's an AliExpress module that's built into the Allo thing. I mean, that's, that's just what it looks like to me. Like I said, I wasn't involved on the production on anything about this product. I was just helping him get the circuit working in the beginning. And then I saw his Instagram pop off and that he, here he is, Sungyu Lee, here he is. And so, and that his, uh, that he was making a product out of it. And huge props to him for doing that because that's a lot of work. And like he said, he did it in a year, which is really impressive. So here's the promotional video. And then, so it's comparing it, the, the plasma toroid to the accretion disk of a black hole, that it looks like that. And here's a spokesman about the project. And there it is in wave mode, that looks pretty cool. And here it is, prototyping. And I mean, it's very elegant. It's very elegant. And I'm pretty sure it's about the same price as Zerg's. Let's go see. Um, okay, here we go. Yeah, so same price as Zerg's. Super early bird, you can get it off. Oh, this is more expensive than Zerg. This is like a premium desk toy version. $650 right here. That's how much it's gonna be if you don't get it right now. Right, here's the video again. I really like that design. Nobody's done that yet, where they've enclosed their resonator coil. This is pretty cool. Yeah, and it has an ignition feature. That's nice. Allo. Well, congratulations, Allo. Um, congratulations, Sung Yu, for making the product. And of course, Zerg. I'm just happy for Sung Yu because he was my Patreon. Uh, $85,000 raised, and the goal was $3,000. That is big success. Okay, moving right along to the AliExpress uh, products. Okay, Plasma Toroid. I'm just gonna look up Plasma Toroid because I know that there are some products that have shown up here recently. So first one, $75 DIY kit. It's got a PCB, just like you could get from like PCB GoGo or JLC PCB. 
It's one step up from my circuit, you know. It probably has some thermal protection feature. Yeah, I mean, this is the next logical step, to be honest. Like, once you know the circuit, just turn it into a, like a cheap DIY kit. This even comes with the plasma ball. So this is a mini bagel gen, basically. But I can't guarantee that it works as fluidly as the bagel gen, you know? This one we're looking at is $140, and it plays music, apparently, with a Bluetooth speaker, and it maybe modulates how the plasma toroid behaves. But I can't believe them because they don't, there's no video. Here we go, here's another one, $60. This one has like PCB supports for the resonator coil, $80. And these are all smaller versions of the bagel gen. So the plasma ball is about like, I'm pretty sure it's only about like three inches, AKA 70, 80 millimeters for my metric people. Let's check out this one here, 100 bucks. Micro plasma toroid, do it yourselfer. Oh, there's some reviews, guys. We got reviews. This seller is top notch. I received my item fast. Diagon Alley Magic Shop. Shout out to them. They did it. It's like Harry Potter, A. It dances around. First try. I got it working first try. Gorgeous. Yeah, so it squeals and dances around. I mean, that's really what we're looking for here, you know, as plasma toroid enjoyers. Okay, this is a neon one. Oh, a neon ball. That's pretty cool. Look at that cute little ball there. All right, so neon. They also sell neon. Now, this is a source for mini plasma toroid balls for a very cheap 35 bucks plus $13 shipping. Okay, good, it doesn't have my address there. That would be terrible. This is a budget plasma toroid right here. Yep, people like it going undamaged. So these guys are good. We can also just do a general search on the YouTubes. Bagel Gen, nice, right there. Oh, there's a, there's a Instructables here. Simon Liu. Okay, actually, okay, this guy. I think he made the AliExpress designs. Yeah, look, it looks exactly the same. All right, cool. Oh, nice. Look at that, that's pretty satisfying. If I was smarter and more patient, I would make, I would make something like this, but yeah. There it is. Sweet! I got credit. Look at this. All right. Oh yeah, Royal Institution made a video about it too. I love Royal Institution. They're great. And there's Professor Ricketts. Awesome. I can't wait to visit the Royal Institution one day. Built it in a cave with a box of scraps. Okay, now I'm just watching YouTube shorts. So, nope. Plasma Toroid Lamp on Amazon? Ah, guys, look at this, 200 bucks. But I don't want to buy it. I just want to look at it. Whoa, looking pretty profesh, professional. Mode rock, I wish, oh, there's a video. Let's go. Turning on the volume, okay. Here we go, 3D printed base. Oh, this is good, this is good. Okay, I like this. I think this is a good place to end. I really hope it actually does play music. Plug it in. Boom. Turn it on. Okay. Start it up. Hey, yep, there you go. Yeah, I mean, this is great stuff.
This is good. I think techno music would be visualized best with this, so let's see how this does. Yeah, this is good. It's more clearly visualizing the techno. Couldn't agree more. Okay, well, that ends my uh, review of Plasma Toroid products as of October 2024. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this little adventure with me, and I'll be back to posting videos soon. I am in the beginning of my chemistry PhD and trying to figure out exactly the project that I want to do. So, thank you for joining me, and have a great night. God bless. Mm -hmm.